What's going on guys? We're out here off Miami Beach, fishing some new areas that we haven't really hit before. We picked up some nice uh, pilchards this morning. It's a little overcast out, a lot of rain inshore of us, but we're gonna try to stay dry and get tight. Let's see what we can come up with. Cole's on. Just saw some nice marks on the bottom while we were doing a Northwest drift. And I let Nicole know, she kind of brought her lead up a little bit and sure enough, man, she got whacked. Keeper for coal, about 20 inches. Let's see if we can get right back onto those marks that we just saw. Circle hook, baby, doing what it does. Set it, set it, set it. He's on there, set it. Real softly, real softly. There you go. There you go. Cole's on. Pole hooked up again. Oh, is that a mango? Oh, what a beautiful mango. That's why I was feeding them. Wow, check out that mango Cole just brought up. That's number two for Cole, second drift. Let's go, baby. That bite is like so distinct. I probably lost my bait. We both felt a nice nibble bite, like a mangrove bite. That's what it was. I think it took my bait. I'm gonna check now. Hooked up, it's a little sloshy out here. The drift doesn't know what it wants to do. Kind of northwest, kind of north, sometimes straight west. But we're gonna do our best and see what we can do. A lot of rainstorms around us. We're gonna try our hardest to stay dry. See if we can get tight again. Just got hit, I'm gonna let him eat for a second. Oh, yeah. oh that's a good one. Yeah. Man, it's got crushed by something nice. I'm gonna get the gaff. Feeling pretty muttonish. Check out this hook set, man. Nice. Talk about almost losing a fish. Look at that. Didn't have my gaff out, saw that hanging on the lip, had to hurry up and grab him. Good fish. Nice Miami Beach mutton right here. Let's go. Check that out. Let's go. On the live pilcher. He ate it. I let him eat for about three seconds. Let that bait get into his mouth and then softly just let that current set the hook. Cole's brought up two fish. I had to hurry up and get on the board. She was starting to give me shit about it. No reason to not hit that again. There ain't nobody out here. Got a couple good hits. One good 
fish. 24 inch mutt pit. What, did you get eaten by your friend or something? Too small to keep. Damn. You want to know you're coming in? Oh, no. Hold hooked up. Yeah, you're on. Trust me, yeah. Hey, you want to go with your tongue? Get bigger. Came out to the came out to the deep side. I just caught a small one. Nicole just hooked up, little keeper. Things kind of slowed down on the shallow side, so we came out to 150 and started drifting to the west on a lot nice long uh, wreck that's down there. When you're in 60 feet for whatever reason, these fish fight so much harder. When you come out to 150, it's almost like the second you bring them, you know, 20 feet off the ground, they just kind of start inflating. I'm big, but she'll do. Nice job, man. We made a move, you know? We made a little adjustment. I love doing that kind of shit, man. Instead of being like, ah, oh, fuck. You gotta make those adjustments to find the fish. I'm just gonna hit this spot again. dry for the moment it's pretty nasty out uh, in the west but we're about a few miles offshore trying to stay dry a lot of lightning going on inshore but I think our safest bet is to just stay out here and get down on the bottom oh, there perfect keep pumping a little bit at a time wow I can't believe that we just lost two good oh, fish. Down there fast. Two really good fish, man. We're by a wreck, so I would have to say that there were maybe amberjacks. Uh, no. Go. Come on, you gotta get a beat. Go. Get going. Cole's hooked up. Something nice. We're deep. We're about 200 feet. Whatever she has on there is nice. sketchy out here. It's not raining, but it's nasty in short.
a reef donkey. says it should be bumping up in the next 30 minutes so we're gonna just cruise a little bit farther east and stay out of the rain i'm good cole got really excited check out her reef donkey <laughs> that's that cuban yellowfin tuna right there <laughs> whatever it gave me a good fight it's a big fish dude we were doubled up <laughs> <laughs> 